emergency. Starvation in Hey guys. Seek calorie intake immediately. <laughs> What's fucking crap, man? Welcome to episode nine of Subnautica. Is that quartz right there? Seriously? It was right below my base and I did that whole fucking mission to find it. Anyways. Uh let's grab some fish to eat. We'll take care of our calories. Um, since the last couple episodes have been about... I mean, we've discovered stuff for sure. But we've been doing... 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. But, you know, we've been uh, focusing a lot on building stuff. Oh yeah, we really don't need this much. Four will probably, probably be enough. For our food intake. Anyways, I want to search out these uh, other two uh, life pod things if we can this episode. And then that'll probably be it for me for tonight because it's two in the morning already. So. Vital signs stabilizing. I have some water. I should make some more. Man, I already used all my tube coral. Oh, my. Oh, do I have some over here, maybe? Okay, good, I do. Let's make some water for the road. Actually, you know, I think I had some extra water hanging around anyways. Yeah, I got a ton of water on me. Okay, well, I mean, that's fair enough. I'll keep three water on me. Okay, now let's go search out some of these other... Let's go check out this high priority person's. Oh, where's my power at? Welcome aboard Cal Systems Online. Before we get going too far, let's uh, repair our sea moth because apparently it got all fucked up by sand sharks last episode. I keep forgetting I got to use the uh, secondary button there. There you go, Tiffany. Okay, now we are going over... Here. It's not even that far away. Let's see what important stuff we can discover. Wait, another one to check out? Yeah, that one over there. No, I thought we already... Aren't we already over there? Thought we were. Since I've been recording this all in one stretch, I hope you guys are in enjoying my uh, fancy lighting I got here behind me. Oh, I should be keeping an eye out for um, stuff to scan since I'm in a new area. Well, it's not that new. I kind of hung out here a little bit. What was that? Oh! Fuck, they took me down to 85 already? Oh, here's where we want to go anyways. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. I thought I'd check this place out already. Yeah, I did. I found it in a previous episode, just on coincidence. Um, maybe two episodes ago? Well, that's a bit disappointing. I love the exploration in this game, though. Like, there's... And just basically go anywhere. Seamoth does get fucked up pretty easily. What was the other one? I thought I heard another... I hate going too far over this way because that's where the big thing was that... What was that noise? What the... Hello. That was odd. I don't know what to think about that. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Oh, this is the deepest I've been yet. I didn't even realize. 
soon as I saw quartz, I'm like, you know, let's stop by, grab this shit. I think we checked all... I think we already checked this other area out here. That's a big thing of quartz. Got a PDA. Apparently, it's for something we already knew. Thermal plant. I think I already have this. I did not. Acquired. Acquired. Salvage, I'll leave there for now. Oh, sorry, Seamoth. Yeah, let's uh, fucking fix you again, because you are you get damaged like crazy. Oh, maybe it's because I need the... Th oh. That's some alien bullshit right there. There's quartz over here, too. I don't know what the point of those things is, but, uh... I don't know if they're dangerous or not yet. They don't seem to be attacking me. Oh, there's more quartz right there. Fucking sand sharks, dude. Whoops. I'm pretty sure I already checked this area out, although this looks very different. Actually, I don't think I have... Oh, this is like a giant cave system. Yeah, I definitely haven't been over here. Or have I? No, pretty sure. How do I get over to this thing? Sorry, I'm just kind of passing up on stuff on the walls here. I just kind of want to... Oh, here we go. Another life pod kind of thing. We're pretty... We're deeper than we've ever been anyways. Oh, hey, let's, uh... From the rebreather. Because we're not around the signal location uploaded to PDA. Integrating new PDA data. Ultra high capacity tank. Acquired. It's just a random creature egg. Ruby. Oh, my inventory's full. You gotta be fucking shitting me. Oh, uh, what do I want to ditch? Okay, ditch the creature egg. Let's ditch the first aid kits. I know we need Ruby for something. So I want to grab some while we're here. Oh, maybe I should be scanning it, too. There's another piece. There it is. Maybe once we scan stuff, we can look, search for it with our uh, scanner room. Oh, my inventory's full. 
Okay. And we got some more information about a place we can go to. An ultra high capacity tank. What do we need for that? Four lithium. Abandoned PDA. Yeah. Integrating new PDA data. Okay, we got the guy's voice log. Let's make sure we're not missing anything else important over here. There's a lot of stuff happening over here. Rendezvous point, dry land. Oh, shit. That seems really important. Okay, let's uh, head back to the base. Okay, I'm going to save quick. Actually, let's uh, get this thing playing. Keen, this is Aurora. Come in. This is Keen. Life pod detached to Cape Planet 4 in 30 seconds. The computer has identified a landmass at the attached coordinates. I want you to regroup the crew there. Understood, but they are your responsibility now. Don't let them down. Captain, you need to evacuate. Negative. You'll need the ship in one piece if you're going to contact HQ on the long range. I'm attempting a controlled descent. Captain! So that's probably when they got shot down. Well, this is awesome. We got another, uh, another spot to check out. Jeez, I was 10 kilometers away? Really? It's just with this camera one, camera two, I can't tell if... Uh, no, that's going to be just hundreds of meters. Whatever. I think I'm going to change the interior on Welcome aboard, Tiffany Captain. as well. Actually, let's do that while we're here. Interior. It's gonna sound cheesy, but I kind of want a white interior. No, that's the stripe. I want the stripe to be black. The interior. Yeah, I want that to be white. Bunch of cords. Some salt. Titanium and ruby. Now, what did I need? Here, I should move all these dead batteries over. I wish there's a way to charge your battery. I need four lithium to upgrade my air tank. Prawn suit, I need ruby for. Laser cutter I need diamond for, which I still haven't come across. Oh, maybe there's maybe there's an upgrade that I need a ruby for. CMOS solar charger, advanced wiring enameled glass. Advanced wiring kit and enameled glass. Okay, well let's see how we make an advanced wiring kit and how we make enameled glass. Wiring kit, gold computer chip. Mostly needs copper. Wiring kit, two silver, okay. I do. Okay, what was I doing with this advanced wiring kit again? Oh, it's something for the sea moth, I believe. Enameled glass. Okay, how do I make enameled glass? Glass and a stalker tooth. Well, I just so happened to have found a stalker tooth way back. I know I got it here somewhere. Where are you at? 
Where's this fucking stalker tooth at? I know I got it. There it is. Okay, and then I need two glass. And I just picked up a little fuck ton of quartz. But, 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 but. So I needed two glass, I believe. Glass. Alright, I got enough for enamel glass. Okay, that's perfect. Hit the button. Fell down. Hey, look at that. Let's add that to our sea moth. Bam! Nice. Now our sea moth will charge itself in the sunlight. Is that not awesome? Of course that's fucking awesome. Drink water so it quits bitching at me. Like that. Man, that is fucking sweet. Okay, guys, this is gonna be my last stretch of recording, probably, because it's like three in the morning. Two thirty-five. Anyways, what is it? We want to go check out. Okay, I emptied most of my inventory. We're gonna go check out another room. Oh, didn't I just make a bunch of food? Why am I hungry? I thought I just took care of this shit. I thought I just made some food. Anyways, I don't want any bullshit sidetracking us. So I'm just gonna eat. That'll be more than enough. We'll have a little extra for, uh, for our trip back. I should probably make some salted stuff. Some cured meat. Anyways. Okay, now we gotta go check out one of these distress beacons. I'm drinking. I've been drinking this whole time. Obviously. All systems online. Yeah. Let's go head up this rendezvous point. We have extra food. We have extra water. Here, let's save quick. Because I normally don't save. We have a solar charger that should keep our um, thing full, but we still have two power cells on us. Oh yeah. I think we're prepared enough. Let's go check out this rendezvous point on dry land. Man, I still haven't explored that whole alien um, infrastructure from that first island we found. Back when the sunbeam got shot down. There's a lot to do in this game. I'm... Oh my god, I'm just getting so into it. We brought a first aid kit, right? Right? Okay, we brought one first aid kit. I have a lot of first aid kits. I'm kind of... I'm pretty glad I made that thing in the base there. We got really quiet here all of a sudden. Oh, fuck. I think this is the area where we saw that really big, mean looking. It was talking about Leviathans and looked like a giant snake. I think we saw it in this zone, so I'm a little, little curious about that. This doesn't look like the... Yeah, I, I, this definitely is... I don't think this is the same island we were on before. Here, let's back up a little bit. Oh, man, we're way on the other side of the fucking Aurora. Picking up multiple energy signatures on the island's surface. Okay. Here, I'm going to save quick, just in case. Okay, here we go. 
maybe I should change my my lighting considering that I'm on an island and not underwater anymore. I think we should head over this way. That looks like stuff I want. Hit. The knife noises are a little excessive. How do I get up there? I think I want to go over this way actually. Jaffa Cup. Am I stuck? Oh, fuck, I was not walking there for a second. Actually, I think this path might take us up there anyways. Oh, I don't want to fuck with those guys too much. I mean, I did bring a med kit, but... I mean, we already know what they are. We, we know what they're up to. Oh, maybe this does take us up there anyways. Jaffa Cup, Ming Plant. Wait, can we scan this stuff? And hear something doing something. Okay, here we go. Three. Exterior grow bed. Multi-purpose room. Oh, this is what we need. That's the main part of the base. What does that say? Stasis rifle. That's also new. Marble melon. What's a marble melon? Consume. Oh. That's what we're talking about right there. Got a food source here. Let's, uh... Chinese potato. I can't... I can't seem to scan it. Oh man, this stuff's huge. Here, let's, uh... Let's drop one. I don't know if we need the Jaffa Cup for anything. Here, I don't want to load up our inventory too hard. But. Man, there is good stuff on this island so far. Found another tablet. Integrating new PDA data. That's pretty sweet. We got another place to explore. Man, there's so much to this game. I'm really digging this so far. This is one of my, uh, it's becoming a favorite of mine. Integrating new PDA data. Fuck you. Wish we had a better weapon. Supply crate. A battery. Okay, well, you know, I like batteries. An abandoned PDA. Integrating new PDA data. Get a 
crabs seem to be bugged. I'm not going to complain about it. Big old hole right there. And apparently we can just walk into food on this island. I think we should go up this way. Man, we already found so many good things. Like with that multi-purpose room, there's so much we can do with that now. Like we can start growing creature eggs. We can make like pets, I think, out of that shit. Oh my god. Oh no. I figured that was going to happen. Speckled Rattler, okay. It's like a... Okay, now, this island has some fucking shit to it. That other island was nothing compared to this. Ah, damn. Oh yeah, we want to head up to this thing, I think. Here, I need to drink some... Some alcohol. I've been drinking, uh... Five Alive and Vodka. I've kind of figured out that practically any Five Alive product works well with vodka. And the nice thing about Five Alive is it has a lot of vitamin C, which I always feel like I'm lacking in my diet. Wait, what did that say? Bulkhead. something else there. I saw something else there. What was it? Spotlight. Oh, shit. I didn't even see that thing right there. Disinfected water. It's okay. I came prepared. Lantern tree. Man, you know, I didn't think we are going to find this much stuff over here. Like, this looks like base stuff. You know what I mean? I mean, obviously we found the multi-purpose room up here. Okay, there's another base over there. Indoor grow bed. Okay, one thing, once we get back, is uh, we build an indoor grow bed, and we use this melon, if we can. Small marble melon. Old marble melon. Okay, we still got the other one. Uh, that gives us... Food and water. So I think... Pick up lantern fruit. Oh, you can eat that too. Okay, well, we're different. definitely bringing that. I can't seem to, uh... Move... Oh, I had to press control for some reason. Abandon PDA. Integrating new PDA data. Here we gotta listen to some of this stuff. Spotlight. Man, this stuff's all great for a base too. This is basically we just figured out how to build base stuff. 
Well, we we can get there. That was probably actually on our way over here. Oh, sir, I said wait for the storm to pass. Your life's more valuable to me than a plant patch. You stop being in charge when the ship you were captaining sunk. I'll stop being in charge when you take charge of yourself. Say, Chief. Chief. What? Do you know how to drain those grow beds of 40 tons of storm water? Or how to conjure food from the air? I know how to prioritize. I'm just saying, if that's so, what's your boy's life worth to you today? If tomorrow you're going to be so hungry you start wondering what he tastes like, let him go deal with the plants. Son, go deal with the plants. <laughs> Bart, Torgo has disembarked the habitat. Interfere with my family again, and when rescue arrives, I will leave you here. Do you understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. And no staying here, neither. This rain keeps falling. Sooner or later, this place will be buried. The only choice we got is whether to get buried with it. Okay. What is that thing? I don't know. I found it outside in the sand. Uh, part of another ship? None I've ever seen. It's not even scratched. Uh, uh, don't fool around with it. It might be worth something. Stand down, Chief. If it were going to crumble to dust, it would have done so when I picked it up. It's glowing. We're not the first people to come to this planet. People? Maybe. Could be aliens. Could be the damn sea monsters for all we know. One thing for sure, we ain't going to find out by staying here. Chief's log, five weeks since the crash. The only other survivors are my son, Bart, and Mida, the cut-price mercenary I commissioned for the journey. After days drifting in the life pod, rain hammering on the roof, the weather cleared and we washed up here. I had Mida salvage the Degazi wreck, sent Bart to finding us a stable source of food. His education is paying off sooner than I'd anticipated. Our only problem is Maida. She says the weather's going to turn. I say she's finding excuses to risk our lives. I imagine she's not gonna weaken her life without a physical altercation, and she's itching for a fight. In every judgment she makes, things go from bad to worse. If she had my experience, she'd have more faith. Humans have spent millennia specializing in how to shackle nature to our will. <laughs> this planet won't cause us any new problems. My one task now is to keep us alive as comfortably as possible until the insurance company arranges rescue. In this part of space, that could be months or even years. Okay. Well, I'm going to save it right there. Oops. It's a new day. We survived the night on the island. We obviously want to go over there. Um, well, that's going to be it for episode 9. Should I keep playing? Can I play another episode? Fuck, it's 3 in the morning. Oh my god. No, I, I think I'm going to call it here for the night. It'll give me something to work forwards to. Anyways, loving this game. Having such a good time playing it. Hope you guys keep watching it. And uh, as always, peace out, keep it real, and see you fuckers in a bit. Bye.